Hi, Air Signs. My name is Debbie, and I'm an intuitive reader. And I'm here today to give you your monthlies for September of 2021. Can't believe it already. Welcome to uh, my birthday month. September 24th is my birthday. All right, so let's get started here. We're going to take each of the signs here for Air Signs only. Uh, each uh, zodiac element is going to have their own video. So if you have someone of love interest here that you want to check them out, they will be up as well. All right, so let's get started here. We have a 10 card spread, five above, five below. I did clarify the last card. This is on Gemini. All the timestamps are going to be down in the description box as soon as I'm done uh, time stamping or uploading all the videos, okay? Uh, so let's get started here. In regards to Gemini energy, I did pull an outcome as well as four clarifiers, okay? So let's get cracking here. Somebody, Gemini, I feel this is you, very, very frustrated in regards to lack of movement here. Uh, you want faster movement in regards to someone whom you feel very, very strong connection with. With the Six of Cups there, you already know this person. Could definitely be dealing with a Twin Flame as well with the Four of Wands here. You want that even give and take. It's literally saying, hey, I'm frustrated. I want faster movement. I'm in my head, you know. I took that energy. I'm preparing myself for this Twin Flame thing, energy here, okay? And I'm ready for some action because I myself have taken that action. That Queen of Wands, you can be dealing with fire sign energy here, Leo, Aries, Sag. But it's really about determination to help ground your energy here, okay? With the Ace of Pentacles. Sorry, they were talking. Uh, and But I feel it's kind of like there's a little bit of doubt in regards to uh, the, t you know, making a decision. Kind of wishy-washy, looking over at that Seven of Cups. When is this going to come? When is it going to approach here? You know, so interesting energy as well. I do feel, let's take the five above, five below for the sign of Gemini here. Definitely been frustrating as well as mentally anguish, okay? I do feel that you moved away from that energy. However, I do feel a little, still a little bit about a doubt energy going on. But you want faster movement. Basically, this tells me with the Empress, she's ready. She's grounded. She's prepared. She's nested <laughs> I love that term uh but definitely you're ready here for that challenge in regards to this possible twin flame you want faster movement with this you feel that connection with them but you want that action you're ready is what this tells me to take that next step in regards to a whole new way of the balance of this situation you want to give. You want to give into this relationship. I feel a lot of ghosting going on as well. And you can see that in the outcome as well. So I feel that you want a decision being made to give into this. But there is still a little bit of doubt. I, I get it. You know, I mean, you grounded yourself. You accomplished it. You know, you're moving and grooving. You're ready for this. But when is it going to be here? You know, is that energy? It's coming. You got the sun card, first card out. That's positive, upbeat in regards to communication. This is where I'm feeling the ghosting here. The sword is towards the sun. So it's kind of like, nope, I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to communicate. That's that ghosting energy. Things are going to change. Absolutely. Work being put into this situation in regards to a completion. Now, got to say it. I know not everybody's in it. But I do feel that somebody out there was in a third party situation. I feel that that third party with the three of pentacles and the world has changed. Things have changed. Things have come to a completion in regards to a third party. Somebody's willing to communicate here and put this effort in. It's definitely coming in with the sun card. That's known as the yes card. So there's definite communication for somebody out there, I feel, for you guys uh, in regards to communication because there's a big change after lack of communication, I feel, work being put in, you know, that waiting, that mental anguish, them kind of ghosting energy as well has come to a completion. So good for you. But I also feel in regards to a third party, they didn't talk to you because they were busy with a third party situation, I feel, that third party with them is done things have changed big time with that third party 
And I feel that that's one of the reasons why they are coming back as well as for others. I feel that they do want to put in that work, but there's definitely a completion and a change coming about in regards to the mental anguish, the frustration, the waiting, the confusion, the everything energy here going on. So I hope that that helps uh, Gemini. I really do. We are going to be moving on to Libra. I did pre-pull the cards here as well. All right. So let me write down Libra. Okay. All right. Hope my sister from another mother's are good uh, right now. All right, let's get cracking here, Libra. For the outcome, you guys have the Four of Wands, the Six of Cups, the Two of Wands. Woohoo! Uh, twin Flame, definitely. All right, so you have for your spread here, you have the higher font clarified by the Judgment. The Queen of Pentacles, you could be dealing with Earth Sign Energy, but I'm really feeling that's you. Uh, I know that you are Air uh, and Sword Energy. Temperance, Nine of Pentacles, uh, sorry, Eight of Wands. Queen of Wands, Eight of Cups, Ten of Swords, Nine of, nine of Wands, and Nine of Cups. Ooh. Interesting. Very interesting. There's three nines. So you're missing for the Nine of Swords. So somebody has grounded their energy here. It's missing. Yeah. Good for you. All right. So could definitely be dealing... <laughs> talk to myself uh definitely dealing with a, a twin flame here in regards to a relationship in the past i'm feeling uh because it is the first two cards here it wasn't the right time it wasn't divine timing okay it's not the right time back in the past all right uh with these two cards are very spiritual as well extremely spiritual i feel that you guys are very in touch with your spiritual side as well turning to source turning to <laughs> I just heard Etna. Uh, but yeah, I, I, I laugh because I always say that sometimes our spirit guides are 10 times better than our insurance company. <laughs> I know I'm going to get in trouble one of these days. Uh, but yeah, it's true. It's true. They are there for us 110% to help us through this. Not that insurance isn't, but you know what I mean. Uh, but definitely, you're holding that pentacle, so there's definite groundedness. Okay, did it take a while? Absolutely. Uh, did you wait? Yeah. You know, you waited for this love. You went back and forth. You were emotional. You probably talked to them. Absolutely. But it's kind of like, I know this is meant to be. I'm just going to work on me. Good for you, Libra. Good for you. Uh, but definitely waiting for this movement with the, not just the temperance here, Sagittarius energy, uh, but definitely just waiting for this faster movement, for things to pick up here. Okay. Absolutely. Did did you think about walking away? You could have. I mean, you could have definitely, because it is a general, you know, but I am picking up some says, whatever. You did the whatever move. That's good. I do that. Uh, but definitely, you took that action and said, they'll come back when they're ready. But I need to escape, okay, from what? From the frustration of it all, of uh, ending the mental anguish here. And that's exactly what you did. Just like I said, you got one nine you have two nines and you have three nines the one that you're missing is the nine of swords so you healed your energy okay i feel that it's been definitely a process i feel that definitely a spirit spirit guide everybody has a spirit guide definitely participated with this strong 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 belief here in regards to your spirit guide uh in touch with that but because you did, you're going to be getting your wish fulfillment, I feel. Absolutely. Especially this month, it seems, uh, with the outcome here. There we go. Two of Wands. That's making a decision to show the action. I feel that somebody has a strong, strong connection with you, Libra, with the Six of Cups and the Four of Wands. That's taking that next step. Uh, with the all the spiritual cards here, the temperance, the higher font, the judgment, hello. Uh, you got definite spirit on your side here, but I feel that your counterpart here is going to make a choice, a decision, to show the action in regards to this strong connection. Uh, very, very nice spread. So let's take the five above, five below, uh, all spiritually guided, even though he's class clarified, okay, by the higher font here. In regards to a relationship, I feel that there was action at one time with this relationship, but instead of 
uh, mental anguish and, um, you know, frustration. Not that you didn't have it here. You can definitely see that. You put in, you served your time, okay? Uh, with dealing the lessons of a twin flame, you decided to walk away. I also feel that somebody took the action, meaning the opposing person here, uh, took that action to walk away from you. You know, that's kind of sad. I'm sorry. Uh, but no, I feel that seriously, like you guys literally turned to source. That's sweet. Very, very sweet energy. Did it, Was it emotional ride? Uh, yeah. You know, those two cups are, you know, half one, half down, you know, up, down kind of thing. And there's water. Water and tarot is emotions here. Okay, so it took some time to regain your balance. You know, you're always looking forward to that, okay? But I feel that you took that time to work on you to end that mental anguish. Does this also say that there was lack of communication during that time? Absolutely. For a long time. It was emotional. Two nines right above and below each other. So long time coming, working on your energy. But I feel that your wish fulfillment is coming in, Libra. Uh, for nice spread, uh, but definitely I feel that it is time uh, for somebody in your life here that is going to make a decision, a choice to show the action to go get their twin. And that's what I feel for the sign of Libra. I really hope that this helps, guys. Moving on to Aquarius, and I got to write down, don't, Deb, don't forget to write down the time. All righty. Okay. Aquarius. Hope you guys are doing well, guys. All right. For your outcome, you could be dealing with the Libra as well. You got the Justice here, the Ten of Swords, the Hangman, and the Page of Cups. In your spread, you guys have the Seven of Wands, the Two of Pentacles, the Stars, the Knight of Swords, the King of Swords. Nice. Uh, the Seven of Pentacles, the Four of Cups, Six of Pentacles. I'm sorry, the Eight of Pentacles, Five of Pentacles, wow, a lot of Pentacles going on, and the King of Wands. So you could be dealing with fire elements here. Uh, Sagittarius, Aries, uh, Leo. Good old Leo. Uh, but yeah, here we go. We're rocking it now. So this has been definitely a frustrating situation, all right, with the Seven of Wands. It's pretty wild because you have, you have two sevens right above and below each other here so you're kind of uh waiting all right i feel to feel the love again all right with the four of cups now the four of cups is quite interesting i am picking up both energies here i'm picking up yours and the person whom you're dealing with so i feel all in all between you both it's been a very frustrating situation trying to make a decision looking at the situation with that two of pentacles turn looking very, very frustrating as to what to do. Because you didn't feel the love from them and you were kind of hopeful, but a little uh, doubtful as well, Aquarius, here, whether or not this can be fixed, okay? Now, I'm also picking that up. You could be twins. Uh, but definitely, I feel very, very similar energies between you two. So I do feel that there's going to be a change in regards to putting in the work to heal the situation, to fix things as well. The star is not just a wish fulfillment, but is also healing energy, too. So that healing energy is moving forward with the Five of Pentacles. Regain the balance and take the challenge of putting in the effort. I feel this is the opposing person. Because I feel that there's definitely been lack of communication. But if you take notice to the King of Swords, right after that Knight of Swords, that's maturing energy. This is no chump change here, son. You know, you have a maturing energy going on in your love life in regards to somebody that very, very much frustrated you. Put the doubt of the system into your mind here, whether or not this is ever going to be able to be fixed here. Am I ever going to receive this love? Yes, I do feel that there is going to be that change. They are going to show that action because they matured themselves in regards to Making things better, making things right, putting in the work, a lot of communication, okay? I do feel that this is going to be coming out of nowhere as well with that Knight of Swords to fix things between you two. So let's take the outcome. You could be dealing, like I said, with the Libra, with the Justice. But the Justice is known for doing the right thing, okay? 
Uh, justice actually represents court, okay? Not saying you guys are going to court, but it's a cool card uh, because it's kind of like, why go to court unless you're there to fix things? You know what I mean? So that's why I feel this energy. Now, she is known for that communication, and she's a very balanced uh, justice card here. She's all about the balance through communication and to fix things, I feel. Uh, after lack of communication, I feel they want to heal the situation. The Ten of Swords known, is known for lack of communication, no communication, actually, as well as coming to a completion of mental anguish, okay? So that's going to basically tell me is that they are coming back, could be rushing back as well, to fix the issue with the justice here after lack of communication to heal the energy as well which is wild because that Knight of Swords is heading towards that star. So that's healing energy as well as they want bygones to be bygones and heal the situation. After quite some time with that hangman, I do feel that they are coming in with communication and a love offer for you. Da, 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 da. Uh, but I also feel for some, because of the justice here, because of the rushing in, because of the star, because of the Ten of Swords, healing energy coming in, for some, I do feel that the Page of Cups, as well as the Page of Pentacles, to me, not all, is known to me as an apology. So I do feel that there is some type of an apology, especially with that justice being the first card out in your spread for your outcome. So interesting energy. Let's do the five above, five below. Did I do that? I can't remember. Alrighty. Uh, so very frustrating, kind of losing the faith. They're playing Billy Joel. Yes, they are. Whether or not this can ever be restarted, a new fresh start here. Uh, trying to make a decision, I feel this is them, to offer that cup of love, to put in the work again, to heal the situation, to move forward and communicate after quite some time of not talking here. <laughs> Being the man, you can't get any more manly than two uh, male cards here. Uh, but taking the action and growing up, basically, is what that tells me to communicate so nice energy all in all for aquarius really nice energy guys i was initially f picking up two energies then they started meshing together of kind of very similar energies together then i was feeling the twin energy by doing so regardless i hope that this helps guys thanks for watching that concludes for air signs if you have not already please smash that like button share comment down below as well subscribe if you haven't already you guys rock. Have a great month. Happy birthday to the uh, Libras in town here. Uh, and congratulations on another year. <laughs> I feel your pain. Uh, yeah, I'm a Libra too. All right. So you guys have a great month and I will talk to you soon. Bye.